Hey guys, there are certain circumstances in which you as a CRM administrator might wish to control the number of fields that are available to your users. The best example I have of this is that a recent client asked me to create an opportunity scoring dialogue for them. The net result is that each opportunity as entered by a salesperson had a score associated with it that would tell upper management whether or not they should focus resources on it. While this is a marvelous use case for dialogues, it's also an instance where one might not wish to expose those scores to the masses as it might unduly impact the way in which participants respond. In this instance, it's a wise idea to disable the field for use in advance finds, etc. And that's what we're going to take a look at today. It's easier than you might think. First, go to the solution you use in your organization. If you don't know what that means, either consult your CRM admin if that's not you, or just use the default solution. Surf to the entity containing the field or fields you wish to disable. Open the fields section of that entity and either open the individual field or fields you wish to hide and change their searchable property from yes to no or from the fields section of the entity you can multi-select all the fields you wish to disable. Click the edit button and change the searchable status to no. That's basically it. Once you publish the entity you should no longer be able to access those fields from advanced finds. Now be aware that any existing views that had these fields before will still contain them. In this way, and in combination with view sharing, you can expose selected field or fields to specific teams or individuals inside your organization. That's it. Good luck, and let me know if you have any questions in the comments below.